Hey guys, Anim Two Gloves here. Come back with another video. Today we're going to be comparing the Will, uh, Ro sorry, Rawlings Premium Series glove and the Wilson A950. This is, yeah, as you can see in the, I custom painted this one with leather paint. It's a bright blue color. I think it looks looks absolutely sick. And all right, so the price on this one will run you about a hundred dollars with tax. So regular price is about ninety dollars. And then this price. This was like seventy dollars. Seventy dollars. And then with tax, probably, probably like. Ten, twenty. No, it's tax is probably like seven dollars on this one, so probably seventy-seven dollars for this one, and a hundred for this one. So this one. All right, let's go over the specs. This is a. They're both eleven and actually, yeah. This is an eleven and a half, and this is. Eleven and a half. This is an eleven and a half also, so you can see, right, there. And then you can see right there. All right, um, let me go over the model number. Sorry, I can't even see this one, it's covered in paint. All right, let's go over this one. Uh, this is the D115PTB. Don't know what that means. If you guys know, drop a comment, because we have no idea. And this is an all leather shell, Mark Pro. All right, this one has an iWeb, or as Wilson likes to call it, an H-Web. And this is a basket web, which is cool. So, how did this one hold up for you? Uh, it was okay. It's not in good shape at all. Yeah, yeah, he got it, like, he got it at the same time as me, like, three years ago. Um, doesn't hold its shape, really, like, at all. This yeah, it's, one... it's really floppy, I don't super floppy it's not yeah it's kind of it's a floppy glove i mean i don't re we don't recommend this these gloves we got these when well if you play like when you play like in sixth grade or like little league i re we recommend this glove and yeah so if you're in one of the younger grades and you play like little league then these gloves would be would be pretty good for you middle school but like if you played like high school college definitely don't get one of these gloves get get like a Heart of the Hide or an 8000 or like one of the Pro Preferreds, ATKs. 44 Pro. 44 Pros. Yep, so here's the ball in the pocket for both of them. This one completely swallows the ball. We're going tune the pink one out. Completely swallows it. All right, um, oh yeah, we forgot. This one doesn't hold its shape at all either. Completely flops. All right, and ball in the pocket for this one. Completely swallows it as well. We flared these gloves like a lot. Well, we tried to. Um, yeah, we both flared these gloves, but I think since, since I painted this glove, it's super heavy now. It's like unbelievably heavy because I put like four or five coats on it and now it's super heavy. So I think this is just going to be like a shelf glove. It's just going to be there to look cool. I'm not ever going to play with this one. So, yep. So that's those. That's that. Um, leather quality. Let's hit, hit that. So this one. It's not good at all. The leather, it's kind, it's kind of rough. Uh, it, it doesn't hold its shape at all. Um, right here, there's like a huge pocket bubble. So the adhesive, whatever they use to glue the palm together, it didn't, it didn't last at all. Um, yeah, the leather is very floppy. It doesn't hold its shape. Um, even if you take care of it, it's still not going to last you as long as like an 8000 leather or like Heart of the Hide. But yeah, so this, that's the review on these two gloves. Um, MLB logo. I um, think that's all that we have. So comparing these two, this one's definitely better than this one. The leather is just a bit better. I can't really, uh, I can't really review this leather because the paint on it so I can't really touch it so I will put a picture of what this glove used to look like it was uh, black and red like red welting and black leather so this is what the glove used to look like before I painted it and yeah that's it all right thanks for watching and see you in the next videos